Hey guys, Jordan here. Today I'm gonna to talk about my top three mistakes that I see often in real estate videos. All right, so mistake number one and probably the most common one that I see is poor music. Nothing kills a real estate video more than poor music. Uh, elevator music and all kinds of bad music that is out over the internet for free is not necessarily the best viewing experience for potential buyers of your listing. So you wanna find a track that fits the mood and style of the home. So find a track that fits the target demographic that is likely to purchase the home so that they can see themselves in that property versus focused on a bad track that is set to the property. All right, mistake number two is moving too fast. Now this is something that you can potentially fix with camera settings by having your frame rate higher like 60 or 120 actually i'd probably recommend 60 and then slowing it down to 24 to make your movements even slower but don't go too fast through properties you want to take your time because it'll make it make for a bad experience for potential buyers when they walk through the house if it is too fast and oftentimes you can get dizzy as well so keep your movements nice and slow. And the third mistake that I often see is too many aerial shots. Now aerial shots are awesome and I think this is more prevalent when drones first came out. Everybody was so impressed with the cool aerial experience of a property, but you can only see so much of a property from an aerial view. You can get an idea of the layout of the property in relation to the land that it sits on, the neighboring properties, and you can see features from above in the backyard in the front. But you wanna focus a lot on the interior of the property because that is where potential buyers are gonna be spending most of their time. So focus on making the content relevant and informative for the potential buyers. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this video on the top three mistakes that I see in real estate videos. If you have any additional questions or comments, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. Let us know what mistakes you see in real estate videos. And uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel as we consistently put out content just like this. And as always, thanks for watching. We'll see you guys on the next one.